Mastering Everyday English. Understanding, dropping by. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel where we make English learning easy and fun. Today, we're going to explore a very common English phrase, dropping by. Understanding phrases like this is key to sounding natural in English. So, let's dive in and find out what dropping by really means. Dropping by is a phrasal verb in English. It means to visit someone informally and for a short period of time. It's a casual phrase, often used when the visit is spontaneous or unplanned. For example, if you say, I'm dropping by John's house, it means you're planning to visit John's house for a short while, probably without a formal invitation. The phrase, dropping by, comes from the idea of dropping into a place, almost like you're casually falling into someone's home or location. The word by in this context gives a sense of passing or stopping briefly. It's a phrase that really captures the ease and brevity of the visit. Let's look at some examples. One, I was in the neighborhood, so I thought of dropping by your place. Two, Feel free to drop by any time you're in town. 3. We dropped by the cafe for a quick coffee. In each of these sentences, dropping by conveys a sense of an easy, brief visit. The phrase can be slightly altered to fit different contexts. Drop in, similar to dropping by, but can also imply visiting a business or public place. Stop by, very close in meaning to dropping by, often used interchangeably. Come by, this is more of an invitation to visit. And that's a wrap on dropping by. Remember, learning these everyday phrases will greatly enhance your conversational English. We hope this video has been helpful and that you'll feel more confident using dropping by in your conversations. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more fun English lessons. Happy learning, and see you in the next video.